Hey guys, welcome back to another video and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I promise you I do not have crazy blue hair. It's just for the video. So are the sprinkles on my face. I know it's been a while since I have filmed a video. I know I said this in my last video that I was ready to film again. All that fun stuff, but I have just been crazy, 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 crazy busy. I there's just been so much going on in in, in my life right now. Um, I got two cats. One's probably 14 weeks now. The other one just turned a year the day I got him. I've just been taking care of them, getting them all situated and situated with each other because I got them both at different times. I've just been crazy busy with work, family, especially with the holidays coming up. It's It's been a lot and I had so many plans for holiday videos to film for you and but yeah. Sorry, this is my first holiday video of December and Christmas, New Year's is basically next week. But yeah, I apologize and I really hope to get back into filming more videos for you and get back into what I love. I'm still trying to get better with my lighting, with looking at myself in the camera. It just doesn't look how it does in person how I see like everything is just much darker and I'm still trying to get a hang of my lighting situation so I will try to edit this as best as I can so you can see all of the different colors and everything before I go into the foundation I just want to say that I used the LA colors green smoothing primer I almost had to second guess myself if this said soothing. With using on top of that, I used the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Hydrating Concealer in the shade 25N. Sorry, that was my phone. On my forehead, nose, basically the T-zone area, and I used on sides of my cheeks here, I used the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I actually got these little trio guys over the weekend. Anytime I wanted to buy them, they weren't in stock at all. So I'm pretty late on the game on purchasing these, but I absolutely loved these. I loved how they made my skin look, made them look very matte, poreless, and luminous. I will tell you that. Definitely would use these again as I'm using them in this video today. But I'm using the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Hydrating Foundation in the shade Fair 25W. Also, when applying my foundation, if you see me constantly looking this way, I have my little mirror over here. I just wanted to point that out. Now that we are up close and personal, this is the eye makeup that I created that I will also be doing on this eye. So to start that off, I will be using the ColourPop Lizzie McGuire blush in the shade Delish. And it looks like this. I will just be applying that all in the crease. And then using the Morphe 35C palette, I'm using this pretty light pink shimmer color. I actually lost the swatches of the names to that palette, 
but I will put all of the colors that I used and every other product in the description box. Next, I will be using this pretty dark purpley shimmer color. I'm applying this to the outer corner of my eye and then just blending that lightly in the crease. Last in this palette, I'm using this silver pink metallic -y color. I'm applying this to the whole lid. Taking a little bit of that last color, I'm just dabbing a little bit on the outer corner of the lid and then just lightly blending all of those together. Once you're done with that, we are just going to wipe away the translucent powder that we applied earlier. Going back in with this blush that I used earlier on my eyes, we are going to be applying that above the eyebrow. And that should look something like this. Using this dark blue color by ColourPop, it's in their palette, it's Nude, it's the shade Don't Deny. For my highlighter today, I'm using the Ace Beauty Glow Essentials Highlighting Palette in the shade Radiant. For my lashes, I'm using Beauty For Certain, a whole lot of lash. I'm applying this off camera, just letting you know. And then also applying off camera, I'm using the Kylie Jenner Lip Kit in the shade Kylie. I am back from doing my lips and my mascara. And the eyeliner that I used was by Too Faced. It's their Killer Liner in the shade Killer Sapphire. I'm going to be using some spirit gum to apply the sprinkles to my face. I will just be putting that on my cheekbones and probably a little bit on my forehead. When you apply spirit gum, you want to just brush it on and then you just want to dab it till it becomes sticky. And then whenever it's sticky, you can apply the sprinkles. My hair is stuck in the spirit gum. <laughs> I'm hoping that the sprinkles stay to this because I have not done this look before. Which I hope it works because I still need to cook dinner and it's like 9 o'clock right now. <gasps> I kind of don't know how to do this. Okay, I guess we're doing it that way. Ooh. Okay, that worked. They're just... Oh no, they're falling. Crap, I did not think this through. There's going to be sprinkles everywhere in my room. Okay, I'm just going to keep it like this for now. Maybe apply more. Oh, sorry guys, we're just kind of experimenting today. And that's okay. Oh, maybe while it's wet I'll put it on. Maybe that'll work. I don't know why this isn't holding. I guess it's too heavy. And this is also why I put my wig on first. So, we... You know what I'm talking about. This one looks so stupid. I'm like, I'm literally covered in sprinkles. Stay, stay, stay on the face. It's just sticking to my fingers. Do you see this? Stay. Watch, I bet you none of these are going to be on my face. Five bucks. And this is what we get. This makes me want to rage. So bad. Uh, if someone out there is watching this and you can find a better way to put sprinkles on your face, let me know. 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out my other social media as well. I have Instagram and TikTok. I will leave all of that information in the description box down below. And I will see you guys next time.